Welcome to Python with Andrew. And I thought I'd answer a question I get a lot, uh, given that we're talking about dictionaries. And people often ask, can I change the key? Because um, you've shown me how to change the value or add, add keys and values, but can I actually change the key? Uh, and the short answer is no, you can't. Uh, let's explore why, and, and you can get around it, but it's not, I wouldn't say it's a particularly uh, good uh, reason or not. But let's, um, let's jump over and have a look at some code. So here we are with our uh, virtual studio code. And I've got a basic inventory, uh, chips, chocolate, Coke, and popcorn. Um, and let's see if we run that, let's see what we get. Right, let's actually save that and let's run that again. I just get one line with my, uh, one line with my inventory. Okay, so if I um, go over here and we've seen already that we can change the um, the value of our inventory. So let's change chips to uh, equal to 25 because we've just got a shipment in uh, and then print the inventory. So let's see what that looks like if I clear that out. So it's gone from 10 to 25. So that's often what we do is we change the value. Um, but the key, which is chips, uh, is set. And there's some rules that we have with keys. And part of this is, is it's like a trade-off in uh, Python to um, enable us to use the key to look up items in the dictionary. And in behind the scenes, it's actually um, implemented a, a much much more technically, and we worry about that, but it helps the speed of looking up um, the key so we can uh, bring back the value. So one of the trade-offs is you can't change the key. Now, of course, we can remove the key value, we can add a new key value, um, but we can't actually change it. So if I wanted to change this from, say, chips um, 20 uh, or, or chips potato chips, I want to change it from chips to potato chips, uh, I can't actually do that. Uh, what I can do, of course, if I if I did this, potato chips, um, and it's two, then of course I can do that, but that will actually add uh, a new key value. It hasn't changed the first one, um, and uh, we're not really aiming to do that. So uh, one thing to remember is when you have a dictionary, you can change the values, that's the way it works, but you can't really change the key. Even if we said, well, why don't we actually take out the chips um, key value and put in potato chips, okay, so we could uh, you know, do that. But what that's doing, if you see potato chips has gone to the end, and we could take chips out of the beginning, we're not actually changing that, we're just adding a new one at the end and removing the one at the front. So we haven't got exactly the same inventory data structure because the order has changed a bit. If that matters, then of course, uh, it's not what we want. If it doesn't matter, it doesn't really matter. Um, so that's just a, a short, sharp uh, look at the key value part with dictionaries. So let me restate. A dictionary is made up of a key for lookup. You cannot change the key. And it has a value, which you can change. You can update and change and so forth. You can add a new key value and you can remove a key value, but you can't change the key. And one last thing uh, that people often ask me is, does the key have to be a string? Well, actually, no, we don't have to have, we could have the key to be a number. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, okay? We could do that. Um, and we would see that the key is now one, two, three, four, five. So the rules are in terms of what a key can be, it can be either a, a number uh, or a string. In other words, it, it's got to be a um, immutable object, an object that can't change because we can't change the key. Uh, so even though we can make the value be a number, a string, a list, another dictionary, all these other things, the key can only be a few of the data types in Python, ones that cannot be changed. 
All right. So it can be a number. And often it's used if we were having like uh, part numbers in an inventory. I use the, the names, but we could have part numbers in an inventory uh, and use that for lookup. So we can use numbers, we can use strings, we can use um, real numbers, et cetera, but not uh, other more complex uh, data types. Okay, so two concepts there. One, you can't really change the key. And two, the key can be only certain data types that are mutable or that cannot change. Um, okay, so hope that answers a few of the questions I've had. And uh, if you like it, please subscribe. Thanks and have a great day.